I get out of this suit, first thing I'm doing is... Well, uh, <laughs> I'd hate to offend your delicate sensibilities. Nuke Noodles, call down the flavor. You look haunted. You've been seen into the spirit world, and you learn something you don't like. It's Carrigan. Seems the Overmind made Kerrigan to free the Zer. Something it put him on a collision course with the Protoss. It's all gone wrong. Everything's twisted. And there's something out there that's set to destroy us all. Zerg. Protoss. He's a strong recess. How terrible. How powerful is something that plays with their feats? You know, I've been watching the logs. Those damn Protoss are still way ahead of us. I can't believe some of the stunts they can pull off. Tell me about it. They've learned some new tricks since the last time we fought. I mean, come on. Since when could they warp in guys just anywhere? I thought they needed some kind of gateway at least. Not just anywhere. They need a pylon or another power source close by. Still, they've been working to improve their tech just like us. Damn, Matt. I don't even know what to make of this last vision from the crystal. Zeratul was looking for more clues about the end of the universe. But this time, he was on Ire. Ire? What was he looking for? He was trying to find out why the Overmind made the Queen of Blades in the first place. She's the one that's gonna destroy the universe? No. That's just it. I think she's the only one that can save it. Future. The end of my people and of all things. 